my channel. This is Karina from Day by Day K, your fitness instructor and fitness friend. Thanks so much for joining in, guys. In today's video, I'm going to take you guys through round two of our aerobics workout. So uh, in today's video, I'm going to take you through the aerobic segment, and then as I promised last week, I'm going to take you through a little bit of toning. We're not going to do much, just going to be a little bit of chest, a little bit of back, a little bit of core, a little bit of leg. Um, don't need any equipment other than maybe a mat if you have one, and then also a Towel. That's pretty much it. Make sure you guys keep your water close by. We're gonna get right into it And actually before we do I have segmented it just the same way that I did last week with regards to like warm-up Cardio one cardio two and then we have our toning So if you feel like today you want to maybe just do cardio one or you just want to do cardio two or just a warm-up and The toning that's totally fine. Feel free to skip ahead. Make sure you do your own thing This is your own workout uh, Take those water breaks as you need all right, so with that being said, don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys at the end of the video. Ciao. Okay, guys, let's start off with a march here, marching it out. Let's get those legs going, get those arms going, going into some bicep curls here, and now we're going to step touch it out with those bicep curls. So keep it stepping side to side here. Remember, get the legs first, add the arms when you're ready. Let's reach it over, just tapping our toes on the floor here, stretching that arm across, reaching as far as you can perfect two arms push 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 keep it going very nice very nice warming up that body let's bring those hands push it forward very good a few more here and from here we're going to pull it back with a little bit of a leg curl here so we're squeezing the center of the back as we're doing those Hamstring curls, let's get into some biceps again. Keep those curls going. Again, really want to warm up that body very nicely. And stepping it back out, crisscross the hands in the front, alternating the top of the hand each time. We're gonna travel up for four and back for four if you have the space. Otherwise, you can just step touch it out in one spot here. That's totally fine. Good stuff, guys. Nice, keep it going. And we're gonna switch into a single, single, double step touch here. Keep those arms moving. Remember the higher the arms, the harder it gets. So for now, we're just keeping it kind of medium height or low. Going into our march again, just catching your breath for a second here, reaching the arms up a few times. And then we're gonna do chest a few times. Keep that march going. We're gonna keep this pattern now. Watch me here. We're gonna travel it up for four and travel it back for four, changing up those arms. Let's try it again, everyone. Very good. And take it back again. Perfect. Hold it here and circle those shoulders back. The single arms here alternating each time, Just rolling those shoulders back, opening up that chest. Now both arms, very good. You can tap those toes on the floor. Fabulous. And bigger circles now, as big as you can. Keep it going. Really getting that nice stretch in here now. Adding on, we're gonna cross the hand and we're gonna abduct at the same time. You can keep your toe on the floor, which we're gonna add on in a sec, or you can lift those legs up and keep them up as we're doing those abductors. Just a few more here. And going back into our curls and triceps here, squeezing those triceps as you extend those arms and push your hands back. Going into knees here, pulling it up. Another four, three, two, here we go. And going into ankles, reaching for the ankles here. Beautiful, opposite hand to opposite ankle. Let's hit the outside of the feet now, so watch me here. Out, out, very good. Another four, three, two, and we're gonna cross the hand to the back now. Opposite hand to opposite heel. Fantastic, guys. Again, really getting those hamstrings warmed up. We're gonna repeat that again. So ankles in the front here. Fantastic, you got it, guys. Ankles out to the sides here. Just kind of trying to hit all the angles here. Really getting that body going. And to the back one more time. Super duper. We're ready, almost there. Going into some heels. Push those hands forward. 
And staying here, we're gonna reach back, or sorry, reach forward and sit back, keeping your toe up in the front, similar to what we did last week. Get ready, we have another four here. Three, two, and holding it here. Hold that stretch. Again, try not to bounce, just kind of holding it here, keeping that toe up to the sky. And then we're gonna take that toe down. You're gonna reach down as far as you can with your front leg straight, your back leg slightly bent. You don't have to touch your toe, just as far as you can go. We're gonna reach it back up and switching over. Push and pull. Push and pull. So good. Body's almost ready. Got another four here. Three, two, one. And we're gonna hold the next one here. Again, sitting into the back there, keeping that toe up in the front. Taking a nice deep breath in. And as you exhale, you're going to drop your toe down here. Very good. Just remembering that if you are keeping your hands a little bit higher, you're not pushing on your straight leg, you're holding onto the back leg there, so I'm never putting pressure on that joint. Very good, let's march it out, guys. Fantastic warm up. We are gonna get into the workout. Let's get into it with some curls. Go, curl. Three more, two. Hold it for eight. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and switch. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, singles travel up. Four, four, three, two, travel back. Four, three, Repeater curl here. Go. Four, three, two, and switch. Four, three, very good. Travel up. Four, three, travel it back. Really get those heels up. Very good. Double curls here. Two, switch. One more round. Two, good. Nice, here it comes. Double curls up. Traveling up with those doubles. If you get mixed up, just take a sec. Find your placements, we got this. Traveling it back, very good. Nice, almost there. Adding on, knee, single, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, ready, hold it here, go eight. So good, loving it, yes. Four, three, and switch sides, go eight. So we're gonna repeat that similar pattern, good. Four. You know what's next, singles travel. Four, three, and travel back. Four, hold that knee for four, repeater, four. And switch. Travel up, go, four. Hopefully we're feeling it already, getting a little warmer. Ready, double knees. Two, yep, do it again. Now listen up, single knees travel up. Go four, three, two, and travel back. Listen up from the top here, listen. Single curls here, go. Here it goes, two. Traveling it up, two, two. Good, very nice. Knees, double, two, and two, good. Two. Let's try that again. Boom. Up. Good. Travel it back. Knees. Good. Get ready because we're adding. Here we go. Heels. Heels and bow and arrow. Fantastic. Keep it going. Ready? Repeat. Eight. Seven. Six. We're gonna do another set on this side. Option is gonna be to travel. Watch me here. Go, eight. You can stay in one spot if you prefer. Good. Four, three, alternate. Go, eight, six, four, three. Repeater here, eight, six, so good. Four, three, travel back or just keep repeating. Nice, four, three, two, very good. Watch, abduct, out, 
Oh, very good. Now we know our patterns. We're gonna repeat what we did before. Go for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, switching sides, eight. So I hope you guys know it. Four, three, ready, travel up. Woohoo! Oh yes, and back. Good job, everyone. Hold it for four. Go four, three, two, and switch again. Option, add on by adding a little bit of a hop. Travel up, four, three, travel back, four. Nice, doubles here. Two, and switch. Two, do it again. Nice, one more. Ankles up here. Very good singles. Nice, a few more. You know the pattern here. Repeater, yep. You can add that hop. A few more. Switch it over, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Let's travel up, four, three, two, travel back, four, three, do it again. Four, three, repeaters, good, switch. Four, three, nice, go, up, singles, singles, good, travel back, nice. Doubles, two, switch, two, do it again. Two, nice, one more time, good, watch. Heels again, starting this pattern one more time. Bow and arrow, keep those arms ready and travel. Good. Nice. Switch it over, singles. Alternating here, four, three, and travel back. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Almost there, and done. Just step it out, got it. Round two, so we're going into our marching here and watch those legs. We're gonna lunge it back, alternating lunges. Good, good. Keep it going. We're gonna change this move to lunging side to side. Watch, side to side. Beautiful. Keep it going. Four, three, two, and lunge it back. Go. Perfect, you got it. We're gonna continue on this leg pattern. Just a few more. Cross it here, good. Nice, keep those arms going as well. Fantastic, back again, and double, two. So watch, single, single, double, pull that knee up. Single, single, double, pull it in, nice. Cross, single, double, two. Nice, single, single. A few more here, keep it going. You got it, everyone. So good. Back. Nice, cross, singles again. Back again, go. Cross it, yes. Back again, watch, two and two. Yep, two, keep this pattern going. Got a few more here, everyone. Keep it going, fantastic. Pushing through. Single lunges here, adding on. Heel to the front, cross it over, cross. You can stay here, we're gonna add on, but you can keep the heel just like this, or a kick. Yes, kick, kick. So I'm kicking to the opposite side. Nice. Elbow to knee twist here, and we're gonna really think about that core engagement, so twist, twist, twist. Good, add a punch with those arms, opposite hand and opposite leg moving at the same time. Good, now two arms and you're kicking, punching forward, yes, so good. Again, this is just more about eye, eye and hand coordination as well, right? So, working not just the body, but also the mind here, kick. Keep it going. Sides again, boom. And front. Good. 
sides, side, front, good, side, front, side, front, adding on, watch, knees up, good, those arms going again, take your breaks as you need, watch, jacks here, and we're going to add on, of course you can do heel jacks if you want, Watch me now. Down, up, up, down, up, up, down, up, up. Beautiful. Jacks again. And you don't have to do the, the little hop either. You can just lunge, uh, sorry, squat to the side and then punch your arms up in the air for two instead. Keep this pattern going, everyone. So good. Jacks. You got this. You don't even need me here anymore. I know you know it. Here it goes. Down. Up, up, down. Good. Down. Good. Woohoo, jacks. Up. From the top here, down. Up, up, down. Up, up. Good. Keep it going, jacks. Up. Now we're going to do the whole pattern from the very beginning. Lunge it back. Go. Six. Good. Four. Three. To the side. Boom. You can travel it up if you like. If you have the space for it, get ready. Heels cross it. Go. Front. Or oh, sorry. Lunging back one more time. Lunging side to side one more time. Cross it now. Kicks, kicks. Good stuff, you guys. Sometimes it's just better to watch me than listen. <laughs> Keep going. Punch it forward. Yes. Kick it again. Up. Forward. Pulling those knees up as high as you can. Work that core. Ready, jack, up, and down, boom, boom, down, do it again, jacks, take it low, down, boom, boom, down, yes, two more, up, take it down, squat, boom, yes, boom, last time, up, nice, down, Ooh, yeah. Just giving me some heels, punching those arms forward but low. Grab some more water if you need because we're going to go into our workout part. We're going to do our toning, so get ready for it. Okay guys, so all you're gonna need today is a mat and a towel as I mentioned earlier. Let's leave that towel to the side. We're gonna start off with some basic squats here. So squatting it down and then as you're coming up, really squeezing those glutes at the top. If there's any moves you're not sure of today, make sure you can refer back to any of my videos on how to. Um, so feel free to do that. I will attach them at the end of the video for you. So again, making sure you're really squeezing those glutes, you're pushing through the, the whole foot, not just the heels, not just the toes, the whole foot here. Keep it going, guys. Let's make some magic happen here with those muscles. Adding on, you're gonna come onto one toe and pulse it. Boom, yes, stay nice and low. Stay on that toe, hitting a little bit of that calf muscle on that side. We're gonna switch, go. Boom, yes. Guess what's after this? Surprise. And up, take it down. Yes, up, take it down. We're doing it again. Keep squeezing those glutes. I'm sure you're feeling that burn. As you're taking it down, making sure that your knees are also aligning with your toes. You're not passing your toes, so you don't want your knees caving in. Double check that. Fight it, fight it, yes. Down as low as you can. Ooh, yeah, feeling that burn. Get 
Ready? Toe. Pulse. And switch. Boom. And take it up. Down again. Oh my goodness. Round three. I hope you are feeling it again. Feel free to please take your breaks as you need. Otherwise, keep pushing through because I know you guys got it. Just listening to that body. Muscles should be talking, not screaming at you. Oh, shake it off. Very nice. Let's add on. We're going to take it down to the mat. We're going to work a little bit of the upper body now. We're going to get into push-ups now because this is a uh, moderate, easy and moderate um, and intermediate kind of uh, workout today. I'm going to stay on my knees for these push-ups. So again, I will post a video below on proper push-ups and different options. You can feel free to do the full push-up or a box push-up if you prefer. Very good. We're going to combine this move in just a second with a little bit of back action. So we're going to do uh, front and then back. So we're staying down here. Now you're going to grab your towel and you're going to pull that towel in towards your chest. Squeeze the center of your back. Try to pull your elbows into your back pockets as much as you can. Really hitting those back muscles here. Very good for the posture, especially if you're staying home and sitting around a lot. Hard to remember to keep that posture. So this is perfect for our postures. Let's go back into those push-ups. Here we go. Ready and boom. Nice. Down as low as you can. If you need to take a break, that's okay. Keep it going. Yep. Woo. I'm already feeling that burn. Good. Keep it going. Here we go. Grabbing your towel one more time and pull. And pull. Perfect. Now you shouldn't be feeling extreme pain in your lower back, so if you are, I want you to do Superman's instead. And you're not using that towel. Otherwise, pulling it in, squeezing that back. Try to keep your toes on the floor. Last round here. Let's do those push-ups. Boom. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Last one. Ten. Woo. Taking it down. Last time pulling. Here it goes. Ten. Nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Nice. A little bit of a stretch if you need. And we're going to add on. So check this out, guys. Again, grab that water if you need. I'm going to set my mat back all the way to the wall. Now, if you don't have a free wall, you can do this standing or you can even do this laying down. Uh, what we're gonna do is just basically, uh, sorry, not stand, you can do it seated. You don't have to lean against a wall. I prefer to lean against a wall. And I'm just lifting my leg up as high as I can, trying to keep my legs straight, trying to keep my bottom all the way against the wall here, really getting all those little muscles in the hip flexors here. So keep flexing that foot and switch. Two, good. Three, it's so simple looking, but it's super intense. Good, just a few more, four more. Three, two, and one. Nice, let's do it again, pointing the toe this time. Two, three. Luckily, we're only doing this for one round. Six, seven, Eight, take it up, yep, nine, 10. Now a lot of people feel this move in their quads quite a bit, so the top of your thigh, uh, which is completely normal. It's those, all those muscles are trying to help this leg lift, but it is a great um, exercise for all the little muscles in your hips. Just, again, getting them used to a movement that they're not used to doing, but reminding those muscles, hey, we can also move this way, right? We're gonna shake it out a little bit. And we're going to add on, now you're going to need the wall, and we're actually going to be doing the wall angle. So you're going to keep your elbows and hands against the wall, you're going to lift those hands up over the head, or as high up as you can without taking your hands off the wall. Try to keep your elbows on the wall the whole time too, so notice I'm not coming up all the way, 
because if I take it up all the way, my elbows come off the wall, right? So again, it depends on your flexibility here and how tight you might be feeling in your back. But basically, this is all we're gonna be doing and we're gonna be doing 20 reps so you can continue on with me here. Very good. As you're doing this, you can keep your legs bent, you can keep your legs straight. Um, you can, uh, you definitely wanna keep your core engaged as well. And um, as I was mentioning earlier, this is what I meant, is if you don't have a spare wall anywhere where you have free space, you can do this exercise standing, not the previous one. Good. Another option is to just hold. If you again don't have space to move your hands up and down, you can just hold at the wall. Or if you feel like really tight, then just holding as well. Now we're going to go into some abs. So just the basic crunches here. One, two, three. Keeping it tight. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, Ten uh, up for two, down for two. We're gonna do another set of these. Two, down for, so two, sorry, set of 10, up for two, down for two. Very good. Keep it going, everyone. And now option to add on, we're going to go with our knees at 90 degrees here. Again, this is just adding on more intensity. If you want, you can keep your feet on the floor. Just again, the basic here. Up for two, down for two. Here it goes up, up, down, down. Up, up, down, down. Again, I don't do crunches very often, but when I do, it's a lot of reps and you're gonna start to feel that burn. And here's the third option. You can fully extend your legs out to get that core working again. Singles, going for 10 here. Don't forget to keep breathing. I know a lot of people like to hold their breath throughout this. And doubles again. Up, up, down, down. Up, up, down, down. Yep. Good. Nice, a little bit of a break here. And we're gonna actually finish off with one more set of wall angels. And the reason for that is again, our life is so forward. I've mentioned this in more than one video before. Um, so I always like to finish off with something to help us with our posture, which is of course working the back, kind of pulling everything back. So once we're done, we're gonna feel nice and tall. We're gonna feel nice and strong. It's gonna feel great. So again, Wall angels or just keeping your hands on the wall is fine as well. You can do this standing any way you prefer. So keep pushing through just a few more reps here and you wanna make sure also that your back is nicely glued to the wall. So keeping your abs tight. And we're done. A nice little stretch here. So hands under the knees, round your back. Kind of like you're trying to pull your back away from your body here. And that's it. Fantastic job, guys. Guys, so I really hope you enjoyed this workout. It was pretty fun for me. I was sweating. I really felt my core and my back in this one. So I hope you guys did too. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to post them below. And as always, don't forget to subscribe and like, share with your friends, and I'll see you guys next week.